Tonight, three people are in custody after a shooting in Jefferson City. The Jefferson City Police Department responded to a call in the 800 block of East Elm Street earlier this afternoon after a resident witnessed two shots fired. The shooting that happened earlier today was just three blocks away from where that school bus shooting happened several weeks ago we told you about. Before the tornado touched down tonight, ABC 17's Deborah Kendrick returned to this neighborhood. Jefferson City Police Department responded to a call earlier this afternoon at the 800 block of East Elm Street after a witness saw a man point a gun into the air and fire two bullets. The witness told police the man with the gun ran back into the house. Jefferson City Police eventually got inside the home with a warrant and detained two juveniles, arrested one adult, and retrieved a handgun. Now, the shooting that happened earlier today on East Elm Street was just three blocks away from where a shooting happened just several weeks ago with a school bus full of children in it. I talked to one resident on East Elm Street, and she told me she's had enough. So we are moving, which it's a okay neighborhood but there's been other shootings over here before and it's just i don't understand why so much violence reporting in jefferson city deborah kendrick abc 17 news the resident you just heard from was someone abc 17 news spoke with when the school bus shooting happened we went back to that neighborhood to check on the family today and neighbors tell us the family did move out police tell us the three people were not being cooperative with police at the time of the shooting and the charges for the three are still pending